uh, getting good on that. Okay, John in Florida. We're gonna skip the break, guys, because uh, calls to get to, and I also want to get to Joel Friday's story about that girl. But John in Florida is on the line. John, a first time caller. Thanks for calling and holding. You're live with uh, Krishan the Don and Joel Friday TV. Yes, the reason that I called, you made a statement, and I'm just concerned about that statement. You said that African Americans kill more than any other race. Uh, you guys were discussing that, right? Yeah, we were talking about how uh, the black, wh- why the black violence is out of control, and I, I and I talked. We talked about how the culture is bred in anger and this fake idea of racism, victimhood, and stuff. I think the statement was that they kill each other more. They kill each... Oh, yeah, I said they kill each other more than anybody kills each other. But they they also kill more than anybody. Okay, okay. I I agree with you. There are some issues in the African-American community that need to be addressed. But I want your audience to listen to this for a second. You young men don't really understand history. From the year 800 A.D., after the death of Christ, down to the 1800s, the Europeans was involved in over 1,500 wars. The history books in the Europeans stated that over 800 million people, that's when the kings was ruling, European countries was fighting European countries. See, we don't need to debate that because if we make an evaluation assessment of the European history books, we'll find out that it's true. Sir, sir, Let's go down you're, con- world you're world conflating war, war with Let me street finish. crime. You're conflating war with street crime. Those are two different things. And how come... It's a okay, ridiculous... Let, let, okay, okay, first of all, let me finish my statement, and then you respond. Is that fair? It, keep it, keep it pithy, though. Keep it pithy. Don't yeah, go on too long. Go ahead. Winded. We know where you're going okay. with this, kind of. Then we have World War One. If we look at oh. World War One and look at all the European... It was a predominantly European war. 30 million people died in World War One. European nation. White people killing white people. Let's go down to World War Two. World War II, the research indicated over 60 million people died. Millions of people were displaced out of their home in World War I and World War II. Let's look at the Civil War. The Civil White War itself. That, this is all irrelevant. This is all irrelevant, though. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, we don't okay. need to go through a, a point, history the, lesson the, on war. But, but you made a statement. It has nothing to do with street crime. Yeah, today. African Americans killed. Today, white. today, and what? I'm today. Give you the H- how old are you, John, in Florida? All right, were 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 people warring over rims and Jordans? No, they weren't. <laughs> I disavow okay. all those Europe, most probably most of those European wars. That's terrible. I agree with you, John, in Florida. How old are you, though? Okay, thank you. Seventy-eight years of age. Seventy-eight. Did you grow up calling them African American blacks? Okay. Do you know where the term African America came from? Jesse Jackson. I want you to tell you. I want the audience to listen because we're going to ed- be educated today. Well, not tell too me. not too long. Did you grow okay, up? No, ask for long. my question though. I want to know if you grew up. Did you say you're seventy eight? I'm seventy eight years of age. What an honor! You're older than a boomer, I think. Much you're older respect. than the boomers, right? I'm seventy eight years of age. I know about history. I'm a college graduate. I'm an ex law enforcement officer. Nice. So I know about history. And the so thing you know is, about have you written me really before? Put- have you written to me before? Sent me a, like a letter or two? No. Uh-uh. Oh, okay. Because I've gotten letters from black guys. Uh, no, no. Did no. you grow up calling it African American when you were a kid? Those did people are terms say that, that term? was put on applications. Those terms were put on applications to make a distinction between one another. We never called ourselves African American. Those are terms that was put on applications when you apply for the jobs. This started when way you, back in the 1940s. In the 40s, they were calling that. it African American. They was calling it okay. If you apply for just say, so when you, when you grew up, people, I, I'm asking a quick question though. When you grew up, okay, go ahead. Go did ahead. people around you and you yourself use that term African American, or do you say something? We call ourselves term? Negroes. Okay, we was considered to be Negroes, but on the application when you apply for a job. It was the Europeans who put that, the white people put that on. Oh, you're African American, you're Mexican American, uh, you're shame European, on them. Caucasian American. That distinction was made. We didn't put that was not a put on there by Jesse Jackson or black people. Uh, All these how false come, information. Who, why did you start adopting it? Yeah, yeah. Can I, John? Were you ever offended by being called a Negro? 
No, not at all, because that's our race of people. Yeah. Just like right, you're, right. you're European, right? No, Caucasian, we're white. No. America. <laughs> it's no reason to get offended and upset. Now. Right. We're it just making a distinction between the races. <laughs> See, there's a lot of things that you guys say. <laughs> yeah. Go back and do an evaluation assessment on history, and you'll find out the true what answers. Because uh, you are putting John. that information John, in the house. Can I, can I ask really quick, John? Um, why okay, does yeah, it, like, um, black people tend to, when comments are made about what's happening now in today's society, and it's obvious and apparent that it's out of control, rampant, that um, you feel the need to go back to history to compare way back, back in the day. It doesn't matter. What matters is what's happening right now. And even if we do go back in, this, in, in the day and say, oh, well, guess what? If we count the numbers, whites did kill more whites than blacks did blacks. Then if you want that stat, then that's fine. But it still doesn't change the fact that it's out of control today. Right. Okay. And it doesn't give us any, like, and you've seen it highlighting on what's the problem. And is. you've seen it seemingly get worse over the decades that you've been alive, I think. Okay, let me, let me give you the answer. The answer is in the scriptures. The Bible says, not only in the African-American community, but the whole world lies in the power of the wicked one. Look at the white community, school shootings, workplace shootings, church shootings. The suicide rate among Those white things Americans are not as common as among, than as among no, the anyway. black community, though. And here's a really important po point, John, is that nobody in any other culture makes excuses and protects their criminals the way that black Americans do. Yep. You can okay. look all over Let's the world. Get... Nobody does that the same way, except yeah, for maybe Yeah, whites are more self-policing. We don't put up with that stuff in our communities. That's why they're yeah, a little bit snitch. safer than the... We snitch. We don't have a no snitching policy. Can you I at least acknowledge you that, though, How many John? black people is it in the United States of America? It's what, 14 what does that have to do? million <laughs> Negroes. All Negroes. Nice. Thank you for men. calling them what they call them like a yes. normal term rather than an African American. I get in trouble when I, get <laughs> Thank in trouble you. When I call that's, them that. That's, Thank you, man. We, Appreciate it. We all part of God's creation. All people sin and fall short of the glory of God. I'm going by the scriptures now, not by opinions. If we stick to the scriptures, it was already prophesied about what's going to happen, right? Then the scriptures tell us what's going to happen when this world ends, that nation will rise against race, nation, the right? kingdom against kingdom, pestilence, food shortage, increasing lawlessness. The United wow. States of America have more nuclear weapons than any country on the face of this earth. Based. It could destroy the world 13 <laughs> times over. The scripture called it the king of the south. Russia what's what's the point the are you making? The they got yeah, you, see, you, seem like you're, making? you seem like you're going off into to various oh, topics. Yeah, to, yeah, you're uh, right. You're right. You're right. You're distracting you're right. okay, from, to the subject. You're distracting from how bad the blacks are right now. Okay, but... And you're not okay, acknowledging that you, agree you, you, you protect that your criminals. That there's irresponsible people in every race. Will we agree on that? Yes. But most, but okay. a lot right now in the black community. Let's talk okay, specifically the reason about that, the black community. It's in the, the reason I don't that even call it a community. That, it's not even a community. Go ahead. Okay, I can, we're not going to do it, but I can spend, uh, like I say, I'm an ex-law enforcement officer. Nice. I can spend hours against you on federal statistics on the white community. Most people in America who use drugs are white. Why are you changing Most the subject? Most people who die from drugs are white. I know. We're talking Most about violent crime. Thank you okay. for your love for the whites. Where's your love for the blacks? Okay, I love all people. I'm just giving statistics. I know, but we just... It, you just we all part of you God. Keep on... Hey, young man, listen. We all part of God's creation. I'm not that young. <laughs> so it, that this race thing, get this race thing out your way. We all part of the human All of a sudden race. you want to get yeah, the race every... thing out of the way when the blacks are the most into race and it's destroying them the most. Okay, and every time and they're destroying everybody like else a, the most. We try okay, to give you like you a constructive man, kind of... And you have, a, Hello? If you have oh. love, understanding, appreciation for people, you eliminate the thing called race. Eliminate that. Yeah. We all part of the human race. That's right. <laughs> if you identify yourself as a spiritual man, race is never a factor. Do I love white people? Yes. I would die for a white man. Nice. Any race of people. The Bible said that the righteous shall possess the earth. And they will find a squeeze of the light. You remind me of Joe Biden, people. though. That's the focus. You're, but you're starting to preach rather than deal 
with the What's wrong with issue? the blacks? Yeah. And why is it that every What's time we like, say something... It's the same thing wrong with the whole world. We're lying in the power of the wicked one. You have two nice. European So they're led by Satan now. How come John, you keep okay. on changing the subject to the Europeans? I'm just, That's what I'm I was about to say. That keep, I'm make, and the changing the subject to all people. The because I'm, I'm, I'm making a point. Now, now, let's listen. I'm making a point. That is violence and corruptness all over the earth. We know that. Russia and Ukraine yes. is fighting the war. <laughs> but why is it that everybody? Why is it that it's only I disavow the Ukraine war. Out. I I disavow the Ukraine war and maybe even Russia. <laughs> I disavow Palestine and maybe even Israel. <laughs> okay, yeah. Except for Bibi. Bibi, base Bibi. I respect what he you can say. do what he wants. And Putin but it too. just uh, let me and help Trump. you out. It's not just the African American community. Nobody it's said it was. Violence it's is mostly. everywhere. Corruptness is everywhere. Evilness and wickedness on this earth in the 21st century is everywhere. Yes, I feel like you're saying that just to make yourself feel better. You're right. We are specifically talking about the black community right now. We get we that there's violence everywhere. How do we fix the black what's going community? On in the world. And you keep bringing <laughs> up black people. your mind. Get off blacks, blacks, blacks. blacks. You're right. There's some there's serious issues. Okay, we're there's talking about the serious issues, issues and then you keep bringing up European American wars. Well. What does that have All to do with it? Talk about the serious issue. We're yeah. specifically talking about the whole world. <laughs> that's not specific, man. It's not it's <laughs> the opposite but anyway, of specific. I, I enjoyed your call, John, in Florida. Call me again sometime. <laughs> Thanks, John. Uh, Chris Sean and the Don hated three it, though. you young men, you'll have a great day. And focus on what the Bible says. You've been prophesied what's going to happen in the future. And all, right. all your answers. Stop lying, right John. Just be enough? honest about your people and make them better. You're holding them to a lower enough? standard. Focus it's sad that an older gentleman Bible. like you, you should know better. It's sad. Yeah, that's true. You don't want, you're deflecting. He's, he, Krishan the Don is right about, uh, about you on this. Uh, John from Florida, first time caller, 78 years old, former law enforcement. You're deflecting on how bad the blacks are right now. And you're not doing them any favors by s- making them feel better by saying all people are evil. All people are evil, but the black. No, no, but we I need to deal say, with the blacks because the blacks are into the blackness, and it's doing them, and it's doing them uh, horribly. And even he will probably tell us that we should we should like help the black community. Like this is our this is our version of help. It's constructive criticism, and then every time we try to constructively cr- criticize the black community, the Europeans started wars. What about Hitler? It's like, dude, what are you talking about? Yeah, right. Well, it was European descent, young man. Right. <laughs> All right, John. Thanks. It's just, it's just... Thanks, for John from Florida. Appreciate you, man. Call, call again. Okay, well, thank you very much. You guys have a great day. You, you well. too, John. Nice. 